I wish somebody told me that networking was a joke. I mean, it's kind of a, a catchy phrase, right? But is it true? Well, if you're networking and you're not actually recording the conversations you're having and documenting like what you're talking with people about, I think you're just wasting people's time. I mean, I know I was. Let me let me back up a little bit. So, are you cool if I just like tell you tell you a little story about why I think that? So when I first started my journey in real estate, I just wanted to learn. Right, all I wanted to do was learn, and my goal was really simple: talk to ninety people, ninety days for an hour each time. I did it. it took me like thirty days. Right. I didn't have a job or anything like that, so I just, that's all I did was just talk to people. And I kept doing it for like four or five months. I'd talk to people, I'd save them in my cell phone, like, you know, Johnny Tsunami, buyer in Tampa, right? I'd save them in my cell phone, and I was like, yeah, this is great, I'll remember, I'll remember everything about that person. Six months later, no idea. I have zero confidence that I could call that person. Probably, I won't even remember them, you know, 90 people. Like, I got a memory like a goldfish. So, you know, networking is a joke, right? If you're networking and you're not actually, like, paying attention, recording the conversation because you're just wasting their time. Because if they're like, hey, I, I want you, I want these things. If you find these things, let me know. And if you find that thing, you don't let them know, like, you just wasted their time. You wasted your time, too. I found that out pretty quickly. Actually, it wasn't quick. It was slow. It was a slow cut of a thousand deaths. And eventually I was like, all right, I'll get a Calendly link or I'll use Trello or I'll save it better in my phone or I'll use a spreadsheet on Google. It was a step up. But I was still on my cell phone, email addresses, Calendly, Trello, everything was everywhere. <sighs> God, it was such a pain in the butt. And eventually I started looking for another solution. I got introduced to this thing called Astro Blaster. Some of you may have heard of it. Jamil Danji's product. It, it was awesome. It was great. Uh, did, it, did it do what I wanted it to do? Uh, no. It was just uh, something that they were selling. And, you know, it works, right? People make money using it. But I found out it was just a white-labeled version of Go High Level. And basically it was, you know, somebody else's vision and business that they were running successfully. And they were like, hey, let me resell this thing to other people. So I started using it, and then I was like, oh, this is, this is like me living in someone else's house. I don't like the drapes. The couch is ugly. Like, I want to change things around, and I did. And then they updated the, their snapshot, and then I lost all my information. And it's like, all right, like, what is this? I know Jamil didn't develop this CRM. So I went and found out. I was like, oh, this is just go high level, CRM, super cool. And it solved my problem. My problem was I was talking to all these people. I was networking, right, trying to increase my net worth. And I could do that now all, all from one place. And it really helped, right, because now my text messages were in one spot. My emails were in the same spot. My phone calls were recorded. I could take notes all in, all in one screen, right? It was amazing. It still is. Like, I still find myself using my cell phone sometimes, but... I know that if I'm using my cell phone to communicate with people, I'm not only wasting my time, but I'm doing a disservice to those people that I'm talking to because now I have people in my cell phone and people in my CRM and it's just like, oh gosh, what am I doing? So now that's all I do. I spend 50 hours a week inside of the CRM, go high level, building it, and it's really changed my perspective on networking. And... That's what I want to teach you guys. Like, I want to teach you how to use a CRM. Like, nothing crazy, nothing, like, super complicated. Just there's certain steps you have to take in order to build the thing that you want. And it's going to take a little sacrifice, right? 30 days. No weekends. I'm not working on the weekends. But every weekday for an hour or so, we're going to learn how to use Go High Level, how to build the aspects of it for your business, and just get the simple things so that you can start growing your business and documenting your networking so that when somebody's like, hey, here's this thing, you're like, oh, yeah, I want to buy that thing. Or, hey, I know somebody that can buy it. And I hope it helps you guys. Um, 
yeah, check it, check everything out. Let me know if you guys don't want to spend the time and, and learn how to use Go High Level and how to build a CRM. Let me know. We'll, we'll build it for you. Peace.